Well, science, engineering, and technology are the careers of the future. That's right, and there's a great opportunity for you to inspire your kids this morning at the City STEM Festival. KCAL News reporter Tina Azadine live at the Los Angeles State Historic Park in Chinatown, where the event has just gotten underway. How's it going, Tina? Yeah, uh, I, as you mentioned, just started uh, the event at 9 o'clock, so we're about uh, 20, 25 minutes underway. I'm told they're expecting some 15 to 20,000 people out here today, uh, people getting their science on, so that's fun. Uh, we're going to show you now that uh, it's kind of kicking off a little bit what some of these uh, booths are looking like because there are 180 displays out here of people that are going to be showing off their scientific side and their creative side, uh, and you're looking live for from our camera at some of them uh, as well. So a uh, lot of people expected out here today and it's going to be a good time. Uh, throughout the morning, I have been introducing you to my newfound friend, Ben, uh, <laughs> who's going to talk to me a little and us about science and how it's looking so far out here. It's looking great. It's a beautiful day. We've got tons of people out here already and lots of activity going on. Uh, now we're just getting ready for the man of the hour, Bill Nye, the science guy, you know, presented by Financial Partners Credit Union. It's so great that they're helping us out. Um, and yeah, we're just uh, ready for the day. Yeah, and this is just for the people that are tuning in that haven't been following us all morning. Uh, this is uh, uh, Maker LA Makers Fair. Yep. Uh, that's the creative side, so people that like to do things with their hands. Yeah, exactly. and then there's also science, engineering, math, and technology, also exactly. known as STEM. Mm -hmm. uh, and that's what they're celebrating out here and uh, encouraging today. Exactly, yeah. This is two big events coming together into one city of STEM and the LA Maker Fair. And we're really highlighting all the fantastic STEM work that happens in LA. Um, this is a real STEM town. There's innovative companies and SpaceX is here and they're shooting rockets off. And this is all about putting a magnifying glass on it for one day. So after I left you the last time, I had the pleasure of interviewing and meeting two sweet young girls, one eight and ten, and they are the smartest things. I got to tell you, it's yeah. very impressive. Girls in STEM. Yeah, I mean, that's what we're doing it for, right? It's for inspiring that next generation of innovators and scientists. The Girls in STEM Club at the Space Center is such a great thing, and, and they're so game for coming out to something like this. Yeah, it's yeah really they were great. teaching me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, okay, so there are some things that are flying in the air. Uh, I Well, they were just a minute ago. Okay, there's one. Yeah. Um, I, that caught my attention. I'm um, like, what's flying in the air? It's not pollen and it's not bugs. It's not that. So right. why don't you tell me what we're looking at, my friend? So we're looking at uh, a bubble machine that's filled with helium. So helium, you know, it's like in a balloon that flies up. So these are bubbles with helium in it, and they're just going to go up until they all pop up there. And they're in the shape of hearts. Um, oh. That's a maker thing. So somebody made that contraption to make a heart with helium in it. So back to the maker part that we talked about, the creativity, the sign there. So what does that teach people in general? Well, if you're going into the science part of it, it's all about polymers, the, the, um, the bubbles, and then uh, helium is about buoyancy. Yeah. I like that. And then the creative part about, you know, adding Making a little and a heart. Exactly. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. That's what it's all about. Right. Uh, what do you get out of this? <laughs> no, yeah. I mean, I'm sure oh, you're yeah. around science that, you know, like, what did you just say? I'm like, what? And a nut? What did you just uh, say? Science nut. Exactly. Okay. Well, I'm a yeah. geek, so yeah. we're good. Exactly. Right. Exactly. <laughs> this is what I get out of it. This is a day where all, all the people that I love come together at one time and just really, I'm, I love science, right? We should all love science. Yeah. It's all around us. And that's what this is all about. Is at the least not be intimidated by it. Right. Exactly. Right. It, everybody can do science. Everybody's a scientist. Um, it's not a, an elite kind of a thing. And you come down here and you see all these people doing great stuff, sometimes in their garage. And it's just a it's just a thing that they do. And that's what everybody should feel like around science. And they can do that when they come out here today. Exactly. Yeah. Thank you so much, you Ben. Uh, it's a free event, as I mentioned, uh, throughout the morning. Started at 9, so about a half hour ago. Goes until 5. Free parking. Just come on out. Uh, get your science on. And, you know, maybe you're not into science, but you're into libraries. The LA Public Library uh, is out here as as well uh, and there's different uh, events and different booths where you can just really get into some of the crafts and the events and the creativity that they offer at the library one last thing before we go uh, you may think to yourself okay with inflation and things going on I can't afford to take the entire family to museums in LA this is a great opportunity to come out get your hands on some of those experiences for free Rachel and Shiva back to you all right lots of great stuff there and as you point out for free mm -hmm.